We all have a tendency to think negative thoughts. We think of something bad that happened to us or preempt something bad is going to happen. Then we play it over and over again and it becomes realistic for us. One of my clients has faced a similar thought pattern. He's a self-made entrepreneur and has worked really hard and got his company to a decent level. Today, he employs more than 100 people and he's also recording positive growth year on year. However, there's something that troubles him deeply. He thinks something bad is going to happen to him. He often visualizes that there is an angry client cancelling an order or a loss of an employee life in a freak accident at his factory. None of these incidents are true, yet they used to trouble him a lot. He looped these thoughts so much in his head that they begin to seem like a reality to him. Did this ever happen to you? Did any one incident, negative incident that happened to you upset you so much that you can't think about anything else but that incident and how you could have, should have, responded to it. What can you do when you're in such a loop? Let's find out. Hey there, my name is Aparna. I am a certified coach and every week I bring to you tips, tricks, tools and hacks that can help you upskill your life. And if this interests you, do consider subscribing to my channel and while you're there, do not forget to press the bell icon so you're notified every week when I post a new video. Did you know that negative thinking is wired within us? Our brains are wired so that we overlearn from our negative experiences and underlearn from our positive ones. So it's biological. This tendency helped our ancestors recognize threats and avoid danger. But situations are different now. We do not need such kind of tendencies. And when we dwell on negativity, our stress increases and our happiness suffers. Of course, negative thinking can be used to find solutions to your problems, but the impact is minimal. It actually harms us much more than it helps us. So here's a process that you can follow to reshape your negative thinking. And at the end of this video, I will also share with you a template that will make life easier for you to follow these steps. Let's say you attended an interview and it did not go well and you got a very bad feedback from your interviewer. Here are some of the negative thoughts that can come to us after the situation. Our thoughts loop into, I will be unemployed forever or I'll never find a job that I really want or I'm stuck in my life etc etc when this happens the first thing that you need to do is to monitor your thoughts when a negative thought arises observe it you'll find it familiar if you are having a tendency to repeat your thoughts over and over again because negative thinking is a habit and when you notice the thought patterns it'll help you overcome them remember what i always say awareness is the first step to any change so monitor your thought patterns number two don't suppress your thoughts Suppression will only help you amplify negativity. By telling yourself, I must not think this thought, you'll end up thinking much more about it. Instead, let it flow. Let these thoughts come to you and then bring awareness to how many times it comes. And when you notice it, you can tell yourself, I'm obsessing about this job interview and creating a loop. Number three, Challenge your thought cycle. Question yourself. Is it really that bad? Or are you addressing this from a place of fear and anxiety? Does the outcome of this one job interview really determine my future? Am I solving anything by dwelling into these negative thoughts? You get the drift, right? Challenge your negative thought cycle. When we separate from negative thoughts, we recognize it and challenge it. We remove its power. We remove its control over us. And when we practice this over and over again, we tend to change our tendencies, which means our habits. So I know what you'll say. You'd say that it's easier said than done. But here's the deal. To make your life easier, I have created a template which covers all the three points in it. Download this template and keep this print with you at all times. Whenever a negative thought arises or you recognize that there is a negative thought, simply pull this sheet out and start filling it. All the three points that I mentioned earlier are all in this one single template. So go ahead and give it a try. The link to this document is given in the description below. So what do you think of this process? Do you suffer from negative thoughts? Do you recognize that you've been looping a certain thought over and over again? I'd love to hear your story, if you can share that is. Do let me know in the comment section below or you may reach out to me in any of the social media platforms. And if you're watching until this very end, which means I hope you like this video. So do hit the like button, share it with your friends and of course do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Subscribe and also hit a bell icon so you're notified every week when I post a new video which is every Thursday. 
I hope you have a wonderful time. I'll see you next week. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.